everyone so final video review for this week is for losing touch by jen matthews if you want to check out my review i have just posted that so if you're on youtube then there's a link in the description below and if you are on facebook or on my blog then there's a link within the post and this is the video review so losing touch by jen matthews um this was a really really sweet story um harry and ash they meet on a mental health ward um after harry has taken an overdose um, and Ash has been uh, in and out of the ward um, for years and it's not until Harry finally arrives that she finds herself sort of making a connection with her and um, Ash has been struggling for years and finally overcoming um, the, you know the demons and um, everything that she's faced especially now that Harry's helping um, so their connection comes um, it comes to a bit more of an attraction um, as time goes on and then both Harry and Ash have to sort of reconsider their future and their plans and everything. Um, so it's just a really extremely sweet story. Um, it has deep and meaning meaningful um, sort of relation to mental health and how it affects people differently and the you know the general effects of it and how it how it is for everyone perceived differently. Um, I all I almost like have to say I absolutely love with with Jen's books. Um, she always takes a subject that is a little bit sensitive um, and, and she shines lights on them to to try and normalise and highlight the importance to remember that um, those sort of dealing with other things in life still deserve to be treated um, with respect and dignity and importance um, and, and that you should be open minded and caring and accepting of all these things. Um, Jen has given great insight in losing touch into um, an experience that's often very much misconstrued and um, it's kind of a taboo subject, people don't want to talk about it all the time, um, obviously we're getting better at it but Jen's really shining lights on these things to make sure that it is included and everybody's represented and there's a story for everyone and I absolutely love that she does that. So um, successfully sharing these things and introducing them to make them a normality rather than something that we don't talk about um, it is something that um, it, that Jen's really advocating and she's what she's what she's done here is said you know it doesn't matter who you are if you need help you need help and this is what getting help means and I think that's a really important experience if you're a thinking about it or or, or considering that you might need some help or scared um, at least you can read this you can relate to the characters you can you can get a bit of insight to know how it might be rather than what you've heard or what you've seen or how it's been portrayed to you so I love that there's that that insight and you can tell that Jen knows and she's done the research and she does know um, it, it all shows in the book so I really um, loved Ash and Harry um, the portrayal of their connection it was really realistic um, for both the characters um, and, and it was not without hesitance obviously um, because they both have personal insecurities so that, that comes naturally um, but I love that the, their characters were completely different yet going through the same sort of thing if that makes sense and um, they shared many personal and, and meaningful and cute moments um, they help each other through difficulties and, and, and be, be they sort of like mental or family or just life and they were just there for one another and they were promoting the importance of being supported and being supportive um, even if you are struggling so if you're struggling it doesn't mean you can't support other people because you can and um, Harry and Asha are advocates for that and it was really um, the truth in that we're all fighting battles that was really sort of um, highlighted in this everybody's fighting something that you don't know about and so that kindness is a really big part and Jen's really built that into the story that be kind no matter what because you don't know um, even if you think you do know you don't know um, and that's that is something that's really important to me as well so I really felt that connection there so um, everything's covered in the story everything's handled uh, with the utmost respect and sensitivity um, it gives you enough to become emotionally connected with Harry and Ash and I was really cheering them on just hoping they would overcome their struggles and they would find the happiness that they really really deserved so I highly recommend this story it's, it's, it's 
a really relatable one for everyone um, and if you're struggling you might just find comfort and encouragement and support in Harry and Ash's story so I really really hope you'll give it a try and read it. Um, I am going to pop a link in the description so you can go and grab a copy of Losing Touch by Jen Matthews which I really really hope you will. If you've read Losing Touch um, I would love to hear your thoughts please comment below please let me know what you thought of the, of the story of the characters because um, it's always great to hear what you think and if you haven't read it yet but it's on your to be read list you're planning to read it or you're now really really intrigued and thinking I want to read that um, again please comment below please let us know what you're interested in reading because it's always great to hear um, what you're excited about or, or what you're interested in and if you do read it I really really hope you enjoy it bye